hi guys welcome back to another tutorial video in this video i'm gonna show you how to create a fast moving effect like this in affinity photo all the photos that i'll be using in this video are from Asplash. if you want to download it just click on the link in the description okay so without any further ado let's open up affinity photo and get started so first import your photo and press ctrl j to duplicate the layer then go to layer new live filter layer blur and motion blur okay so i apply live filter so that i can change the value whenever i want but if you apply filters right here once you set the value you cannot change it anymore okay so instead i use live filter okay so set the radius to the max 100 pixel and because the object is facing to the side so just leave the rotation at it is at zero percent or you can change it to 180 it's the same but if it facing downside or upside you need to change it to 90 or 270 okay so just follow the direction of the object okay i'm gonna set it back to zero then i close it okay now as you can see now you get this fast moving effect but we just want to apply it to the background so i will use brush tool and make sure you use soft brush or light brush so I'm gonna use soft brush and make sure the foreground color is black. Then select the motion blur layer. Okay, so make sure it's selected. Then just pan over the object like this. Okay, so just focus on the center of the object and leave the edges of the object blur as it is and the wheel as well just leave it blur okay and if you pan over some area by mistake you just need to change the foreground color to white and just pan over the area again to blur it like this okay so this is the final result so this is before and this is after okay as you can see it looks like the car is moving in high speed okay and that was how to apply fast moving effect to your photo and it's not just car you can use this effect on any moving object like ball plane or ship or any living object as well like bird flying or horse running or any moving and living object and you can try it yourself okay so that's it for this video i hope you enjoy and learn something new from this video hit the like button if you like this video don't forget to subscribe if you have already and I'll see you guys in the next video.